First, you need to understand what these numbers represent. You'll see them all the time when referring to theater surround sound speaker design. In short, these are the speakers or channels in your surround sound configuration. So the first number is for the primary channels at or near your head level. The second number is the number of bass speakers. And the third number is the number of speakers in other parts of the room, such as overhead. So stereo sound or 2.0 is two speakers, a left and a right channel or speaker with zero subwoofers. When you see 5.1, it represents five primary channels around you. One center speaker in front of you for the dialogue and two front left and right speakers. The two side or back left and right speakers with one subwoofer. In a 5.2 configuration, the only difference is two bass speakers instead of one. You can also have a 5.1.2, the same as the 5.1, but it also has two height channels or two more speakers that are placed at the ceiling level to have sound that comes from above you. When you see 7.2.4, you have six surround speakers, one center channel for dialogue, two sub speakers, and four speakers above you needed for Atmos and DTSX surround technologies. If a movie is mixed for seven speakers and you only have five, the system will move the sound to other sets of speakers making newer movies backwards compatible. Another thing to point out about these numbers is that with some of the newer receivers, them having so many more channels that can be assigned to different speakers, you're starting to see systems like a 17.4, and this is a system with five primary speakers and four subwoofers, and then all the other 12 speakers can be assigned to any location in the room, so they just group them all into the first number.